We could have actually left them alone, come to think of it. I left the park immediately. I felt bad for leaving Yoko, but I couldn't stay there. The emergency medical service will probably take care of her body. Takami's too. This'll be all over the news tomorrow. Same same style of death as well, worth noting. But until then, at least I know she'll be in a safe place. Who killed her? Alright. I have to find my next sacrifice quickly. I've got no time to waste. I need to find the other cursed bears and collect their souls. Killing Takumi barely got me any soldier eggs. I guess he mustn't have been a curse bearer after all. It's not enough. The soul of a non curse bearer amounts to a little more than leftover breadcrumbs. And how's the percentage work if. If things grow over time, if, well, if the cost grows over time, how could we get a percentage base on that? I have to think of places where the other curse bearers of the Seven Mysteries would be. The curses were activated around midnight, the others are bound to be active still. I should check to see if there are other places with connections to the Mysteries nearby. Or, or at the very least, an... Another curse bearer might be thinking the same as me, meaning I could run into them. I see. Which of the seven mysteries are closest? I'm in the Kinchi Kinchicho area right now. Haunting clappers are on the other side of Oyoko River, just near the Shimoku Bridge. The foot washing mansion and the ever burning lantern. Are around South Warigisui Street, past the train tracks. And further along Oy Oyoko River, I'll find the beckoning light at Honji Bridge. Those three places are the closest. I guess I should start there. Okay, think items move. Ooh, huh. Wow, self portrait. I'll collect the other Curse Bearer's souls before dawn, bring Yoko back to life. Should Go to another location connected to the Seven Mysteries of Hanjo. Yeah, could have just not killed them. Is this the same? Items. First stone. First stone of the Whispering Canal is one of the Seven Mysteries of Hanjo. 1% soul drag. Oh, I can't look at it. Okay, let's move. Ooh, where do I want to go? I think I want to go here first. Lantern was the first thing we came across. Yeah, the lantern. And that's the one that interests me the most. South. Does say south. It does say street. Both the foot washing mansion and the ever burning lantern are from this area. It's this late at night, even a road as big as this. This one is. The silent is the grave. Is it just me or is it oddly dark around here? Could this be? Hey. Could this be? Is this darkness the work of a curse? I already fulfilled this conditions to kill. Should I get out of here? Or should I stick around and figure out just what I'm dealing with? I know it's past midnight. But it still seems oddly dark around here. And this feeling is the same as before. Uh. Ooh. Okay. Well, that's a start. That is a start. Can I just. Okay, so I could just move out there. I can't go back to the park. Good to know. Let's go for it. There. There's something over there. Is that curse echo? Curse of the seven mysteries given form? I knew it, there's a curse bearer around here. So do we have our curse flying around? Also a good question to ask. Is that curse echo what's causing this darkness? Doesn't seem hostile. Is it trying to tell me to come closer? What should I do? 
Observe. No, approaching it would be foolish. I should keep my distance. It's so stupid. It's fine. Okay, fine. Get closer. Nothing's gonna happen if I just sit and wait. Let's check it out. Don't you dare. There's a bird on him. Okay, too close, bud. Too, 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 wait. Now what? This isn't a curse doing this. Someone's pulling me in. Ah, that hurt. Looks like I'm inside a building. Did it toss me in here? Can't see squat. Is this the same darkness from the curse echo? They got me. This has to be the work of another curse bear. Is this darkness because of curse echo? Or are they trying to trap me here? Guess I should be glad they haven't killed me yet. If I don't start searching for a way out. Can't see a thing. If only I had a source of light. Source of light. I assume I can't move. Yep. Made of concrete, I think? I'm in a pretty small room. Can I keep moving? Maybe it's like a garage space or something. Can't seem to find an exit, though. Keep moving. Nope. Whoa! My stomach feels like it's ripping apart. Oh, phenomenal. Ever burning show go. Wait, what was my last achievement? Oh, they're all they're all Shogo's Witness the death of Shogo Oki okay. Witness the death of Shogo Less than favorable result. Yes, yes, I'm back here. Mere conjecture on my part, but perhaps you you might have survived. If only you could have done something about that pesky dark Oh no, it's a choose your own adventure game. Fear not. You may make as many attempts as you please before approaching the first echo. Very well, just remember, it's never wise to linger in the dark. Okay. Um, hmm. So the answer does not lie here. I feel like people go to Shumo and Virgeria first. Go to the bridge. Wait, they're both bridges. I was here. Shoot, can't remember. Oh, howdy, partner. I'm here at Hoonji Bridge, the location linked with the beckoning light. Oh, that's the beckoning light I was looking for, perhaps. Okay, I think. Beckoning light should be around here somewhere. Hey! Beckoning light. You know, maybe it would have been far shore. The other side is an industrial district. And further down the bridge is a temple from which it gets its name. Okay. Or, oh, I can't look around? Okay. Surroundings. Hardly anyone's around. Not surprising, seeing as, as it's past two in the mor- Gee. Oh, right. No, that makes sense. Feels like the whole world's gone to sleep. Um, bridge? Partially? Okay, here. Oh, and G Bridge is a pretty un unusual structure. The ends are stone, but the middle is steel. The ends are stone, but the middle is... That is odd. The Oyoka River beneath it is actually a canal, which was dug during the Edo period. Okay. I think... Nope. Okay. We'll talk to man. We'll look at man. Someone standing on the bridge, silhouetting themselves against the sky. Okay. Ooh. Wait, wait. Fine. Fine, I'll go first. Whoa. Jeez, quick draw, partner. Hmm, I see. Interesting. I don't know what he... Okay, he's smooth. Not really a cowboy. Yeah, he's smooth. So let's go for it. Well, no. This is a surprise. Eh? Who are you? 
Not too smooth, though. If you've got the wrong guy, just say so. Man. He's a flamboyant fellow. One bat an eyelid if this were the inner city, but he stands out like a sore thumb in these parts. Come now. Wouldn't hurt to tell me at least your name. To at least tell me your name. I'm gonna give him my name and then I'm just gonna die because of it. What are you doing here? Very good. You shouldn't give up your name so easily, especially not to strangers. Gone is the age where night m her might made right. Nowadays, it's information that rules the world. You do well to remember that. You're the one who asked. Your name, your address, your phone number, your age, your occupation, your personal information is much more valuable than you might think. You should treat those things with care. So, I guess you don't plan on telling me anything either then. You could call me Richter Kai, private detective. Like him already. Didn't you just say not to... Never mind. You say you're a detective? That's correct. I'm a man who deals in secrets. Don't expect me to share any more information with you, though. I only told you that we could have an understanding. Richter Kai. Kai Richter. Ah, yeah, that makes sense. Sorry. Person of interest. He is, in fact, quite interesting. Richter Kai. Private investigator. Male. Eccentric man that brought Shogo Gamer right into a Hoenjik bridge. Uh, do we have? Is he just... Uh, check your chair one? No, I guess he'll tell us if it updates. Okay, Richter Kai, what do you want? What's a detective doing around here? Working, and that's all I'll say about that. I could ask you the same thing, though. Seems like a strange place to stop. What brought you here? You here. Oh, strange man. Looking for someone, why should I tell you? What's he digging for? Is he digging for something or is he just a guy on the street? Past midnight, as usual. Uh... I'm too nice. Too nice? Too nice? <sighs> why should I tell you? I see. Clearly, you didn't stop here just for the chance to talk to me. Which begs the question, what did you expect to find here? Maybe this bridge simply appeals to you. But then why would you go out of your way to drop by in the middle of the night? Hmm. Let's see if he knows anything. He's a detective. Beckoning light. Looking for the beckoning light. A beckoning light? Aha, the seven mysteries of Hanjo. That's right, a friend of mine was really into that kind of stuff. She said the beckoning light appears here in the middle of the night. Mind to see for myself. Ha 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 ha. Really, you're the adventurous type, aren't you? Unfortunately, I think you're out of luck. I've been here for a while and haven't seen any strange lights. Ah, oh, right, well, thanks for telling me. But just... But just wait one second, there's still time for it to appear. Why don't we wait together? Thanks, I'm good. Really? Well, I'm sorry, I couldn't be of any more help. Um, I think. It seemed like he has anything to do with the cursed Paris, I should move on. If he's been here for as long as he says, there's a good chance he's seen something. But I don't think it's worth asking, he seems like all kinds of trouble. He's a detective, what's the worst he could do? I've already died twice. Ah, that's right, I meant to ask. Do you have a light on you? A light? You mean for cigarettes? Sorry, I don't. Not a smoker. Oh no, this'll do nicely. Are, are you sure? Can I... 
Anyway, I should get back to work. Once you're gone, of course. No reason I can't be here. Of course, my work is top secret. Okay, uh, adios then, bud. Adios then. Okay, so everything's leading us to this light. A light. Jumoku Bridge area. Jumoku Bridge is supposedly where the bell of the haunting clappers is supposed to be. Wandered around here for a while, but I didn't see anything interesting. The only one thing I found a light. Oh, thank goodness. Looks like a hundred yen lighter someone threw away. Don't know if Chris are vulnerable to fire, but maybe I'll find a use for it. Good. A light. Okay. We're good. Nothing around? An odd camera angle. There's a ton of cigarette butts thrown across the ground too. This place is a wild need for some wooden clappers to warn about fire. Okay, two plays that need fire. Let's go to the bridge. At least the bridge doesn't kill me. Yet. Got your light. Oh. Something else you need. Not just passing by. Is that so? Items. Can I look at it? Cheap lighter I find lying around. Barely has any lighter fluid left. Oh no, it barely has any lighter fluid left. I could go like this man's cigarette, but then would I have enough for... Oh, why not? I'm too nice a guy. Anyways, I should get back to work once you're gone, of course. No? Can I... No? Can't give it to him? What if I gave it to him before? No? Can I... What if how to give? Does... Okay, fine. Fine. Up to the streets. Whatever it is, I think it's still here. Curse echo, causing this darkness. What should I do? Get closer. Okay, let's check it out. You really did not have to get that close. Although it is horror. Stuck in a garage. Items. Lighter. That's right. Still have the lighter I picked up earlier. Perfect. It works. Now I can make out my surroundings a bit better. What the? Something. Ah, he's got a light that ruins everything. Someone there. You a curse bear. It's over. Time to get out of here. Kill or be killed, kill or be killed. You know what, let's see if nothing happens. Wait, he's running? Is he right here the whole time? This is my chance. Man, tripped. Ah, oh, what the? Wow, what? Ha, ah, ha. Ah. That's a close one. Didn't catch a glimpse of the curse bearer, but it seems that, like I'm alright. What? 30%? Curse must have had something to do with light and darkness. My guess would be the ever-burning lantern? So there's a connection between the seven mysteries and the way their curses work. That might be useful to know. And this is why you study. So I didn't activate it, but it's still activated. When was that? The ever burning lantern is a curse responsible for this. I guess maybe its condition is something about me being in total darkness. Good thing I had the slider, it seems to have saved me. Sit out. Uh, cheap lighter, barely. Okay, no. Okay, still has lighter fluid. Okay, I've had a look around the area. I should head somewhere else now. Where to next? 
first around Midoricho Park at the end of South Wa Maragesui Street is the Taika o Sugaru. North there is a school called Komagata High School at the location of the Fool's Procession. It should be around here. Uh, I think I be believe I'd like Fool's Procession. I think. Yeah, that's been a while though. Let's check there. Red Gates. Here I am at Koma Komagata High School. There's no sign of cursed bears or cursed echoes. I should search a different location. Okay, so nothing here. The school is supposedly on the former side of Daimyo's residence where he encountered the Fool's Procession. It's now at the center of a quiet residential area. There's not a person in sight. Uh, a uh, co-educational municipal high school with 632 attendees. Its name is commonly shortened to Coma High. Although, it's, although it opened as Hanjo First Middle School in 1943, the sub subsequent revisions to its enrollment policies saw it change its name, becoming Komageta High School. The school strives to instill its students with the three S's of Sumida, sound morals, so social responsibility, and strength of spirit. But success has been limited. Plagued by delinquency, it has been forced to turn temporary employees to compensate for its high staff turnover, and its sports clubs face challenges with its inner city location and small campus. Its traditional culture research club is thriving, however, even on issuing regular bulletins in collaboration with local record with a local records office. Hope you got that all. Ooh, every That's why I don't do rap. School gates. They are in fact gates. Climbing over looks easy enough. Can I climb over it? Nope, can't climb over it. Although it is still unchecked. Okay, I guess let's move. Oh, I love how you could just look up high. Gymnasium. My gymnasium looks silently from the grounds. Doesn't look like anyone is there. Yeah, that's spelled right. I just one of those that's see a word a lot of times. Idoricho Park. Two dudes. Idoricho Park, location of the Taiko of Suguru, one of the seven mysteries. Someone's there. Two men, one middle-aged and and the other a young adult, talking to each other. There's a good chance that one of them could be... I mean, sure, I guess people lingering around at night. Try to scope things out without being spotted. Let's pick up their conversation from this distance. I'll have to focus in and watch them for a while, I think. If it looks like I'll be spotted, I'll quickly hide behind a tree to move out of sight. Should I do it? They're supposed to be around here, but I don't see anyone, boss. 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 Oh, I like this. No need to get ahead of ourselves. I bet we'll see something. We s I bet we see something before the night's done. Maybe you're right, but still, the seven mysteries. Huh? Is that noise from behind us just now? This guy is hiding. Oh, never mind. <laughs> Must have been the wind. Should be okay. Now to listen to the rest of their conversation. But does a curse really let you kill someone with an object like that? Huh? Sorry, son's been bugging me. Gonna have a check back there. Yoi. Oh, nothing. Guess this place is just keeping me on edge. <laughs> the boss, or sir, do you bind him? Oh, I, you know, I saw that coming. I jumped. Sorry. Ooh. You might if we ask you a few questions. Oh, young man. Okay. Well, they found me. Ooh. Look at that guy. Oh, you two are police officers. Ha! 
People often say we don't look it. Sorry if we startled you. I'm sure there's no problem, but we'll have to ask you some questions as procedure. Wait. Oh, I'm Junerio. From the Metropolitan Police Department, Investigative Division. Nice. And the old guy with me, Scowling Mug, is Chief, Chief Inspector Tetsuo Tsutsumi. Right, Superior Officer. I, you wouldn't guess from that frown, but he actually has quite a sweet tooth. Aww. Ariel, quick blabbering. Aww. Okay. There's no love interest. Sure, we'll go. Mail, Chief Inspector, the corrupt police detective that Chogoki met at the park. The fresh faced police detective. Okay. Um, I think. They're detectives. They're not investigating the course of here, are they? Or maybe they're investigating another. No, I'm still fine anyway. It's not like curse could show up as evidence in a police investigation. Hardly believe how calm I am. I just need to keep a cool head and not panic. Let's look at you. He's as intimidating as I'd expect the veteran cop to be. First that private detective, now police detectives. What day of all days? I always imagined detectives as blunt and aggressive, but I guess there are some pleasant ones too. Those are the ones that are fresh and young and haven't been molded by darkness of society quite yet. Sure, let's talk. Leave the questions up to him. I've got nothing to ask. You're, you're a fresh face boy. Why do you talk like that? Your lips puckered out. And you know, it's smooching. Now first, can you show me some ID with your name, address, and occupation? I'll be okay. I'm better off just getting going along with it. Wow, you work for Hihaku Subs? I hear they've been raking it in lately. Is that true? Don't know much about that, I'm just a recent hire. People are loving the new hair product you have. I use it all the time myself. Thank you for your patronage. There you go, you use... <laughs> there you go, you use... You, you use hair products. Get with the times, boss. Guys nowadays all use these things. Isn't that right, Mr. Okie? Uh, yep, sure. We even make men's cosmetics now. Don't be afraid to use cosmetics. That's so. Uh, what a time we live in. Sorry, boss is the kind of caveman who thinks only using a bar of soap for all his washing makes him cool or something. I don't think that. I don't just don't care enough to use anything else. Actually, we do have all-in-one souls for just that purpose. There are plenty of people like you. Ha! Hear that, Ar Ariel. Now that's what I'm talking about. You should put out more of those. Aren't you what? Aren't you riled up? Anyway, Monsieur o Okay, what is it that you're doing here? Um, actually, I'm searching for the set. Wow, but just outright gold. Well, okay, sure. Have you heard of the Seven Mysteries of Hanjo, Detective? Yeah, yeah, I've heard of them. We were just talking about them a minute ago. The girl I know was into them. That's how I got interested. I see. I seem to remember when Midori Cho Park had one of the mysteries associated with it. What was it again? Uh, it was the uh, Haunting Clappers. No, Haunted Clappers was... Was Haunted Clappers topside, huh? You sure about that? Nope, that's just me being bad. No, it's the Taiko Tsuguru. Tsugaru. Whole area used to be the residence of the Tsugaru, a clan of samurai. Oh, jeez. You sure you're really interested in the Seven Mysteries? Ah, oh, sorry. There's so much to remember. I got a little mixed up. Come now, boss. It's not like there's an interrogation. So that's why you're hanging around in the middle of the night. Discover anything interesting? No, nothing. 
Though I admit I haven't been looking in these things too hard. Right, I think I understand your situation. Thank you for your answers. Keep giving him that accent. That's quite late, so you'd best be headed home. Okay. Oh, something wrong? You're free to go. Uh, stay. You'd know some things I want to know about. Um, excuse me. Since you de detectives are around, does that mean something happened around here? <laughs> well, we are investigators, so it is indeed related to a case. But don't worry, there's no threat to civilians whatsoever. We'll be here a while longer looking into things, but you can rest easy. While longer, huh? That's not good. This may be my only chance. Well, I'll be going now. Take care. Uh, let's see, I think. Well, I'm fairly sure one of them is a curse bear. Getting to them to leave would be hard. Maybe I should go somewhere before they get any more suspicious of me. Interesting, so they have to leave. It's not just their backs are turned behind me. I'll grant it their detectives. No, we're done here. Get on home. I haven't figured out you yet. Okay, just go to high school then. Weird giving me a choice. Always weird. Here I am at Komogata High School. Once again. Nothing new. Nothing new. Nothing new. Jump the fence. Let's see here. Ah, someone's there! Huh? Oh, what the? Ouch. I'm so sorry. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm fine, but did you just climb over the school gate? Okay, what you? Girl in a school uniform came climbing over the front gate. She must be a student here. Still in the school uniform. Why? Oh, that thing she's hold hiding in her hand. No doubt about it, that's a curse stone. Ha <laughs> ha, oh dear. This girl's a curse bear. Okay, so you didn't hide it too well. Girl, if she's a curse bear. Oh dear. What's going on? Why are you at school this late? Dom, well... I'm really sorry, I'm in a big hurry right now, so I gotta go. Hey, wait. Huh? Curse. Meh. Why? Can't be... You know, I'm sorry. Yeah, I'm not using my curse. I'm not using my curse. Interesting. 36? Ah. <sighs> ah. I killed her. Yes! Oh, wow. I got a curse bear! This is working, I just have to keep it up. How many more do I need? One, two? Oh, buddy.